Hello everyone, this is Pisces Empress 555 coming at you with another reading. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. We're going to today, Pisces, look into your energy as to what you're feeling at this time. Coming out of a very painful cycle, uh, what are your next steps? So, let's get started, okay? Please just leave me a comment in the comment section below. Let me know if this resonates for you. Please like, share, and subscribe. Hope everyone is having a great day. Hope you have a great week. Messages for Pisces. Messages for Pisces. Messages for Pisces. Okay, Pisces, at this time, you're in the reversed uh, strength card energy. So this could mean, Pisces, that you are at a point where you are gaining your strength back gradually from a very challenging situation that does not mean that you're weak that just means that you are um, at a place where you feel like you're getting stronger because Pisces this situation that you went through was very painful um, very challenging and it put you in a place of deep introspection and reflection right so you faced the hangman energy in a reversed. Even though you are not in the situation anymore, you still are in limbo. You still are figuring out what's next. Some of you guys could be thinking, um, do I want to reconcile with this person? Do I really want to put myself back into this situation? Or do I want to go the opposite way towards abundance? A more suitable situation, right? So, let's clarify the hangman in the reverse. Clarify the hangman in the reverse. Yeah. So, Pisces, you are in the king of swords energy coming out of the hangman in reverse. So, you are well aware as to the obstacles that you're going to face, right? You're not at a point where you're oblivious to the fact. You're not oblivious anymore. You are well aware of what has happened, what you want that's going to be better for yourself because guess what? You're in the judgment energy, right? You are taking ownership. You are relying on transforming from this situation relying on the guidance from the Holy Spirit as to how to come out of this painful cycle, right? You are surrendering to whatever's going to bring you peace and tranquility at this time. Okay. Because look, you face the reverse six of wands energy coming out of the wands. You could be affiliated or um, dealing with an Aries Leo Sagittarius. 
So coming out of the Six of Wands, just not feeling like you have to battle much anymore because it was a very trying, I would say, situation for you guys. So let's clarify the Six of Wands in a reverse. Clarify the Six of Wands in a reverse. And it puts you in the Eight of Cups in a reverse. Not feeling like you could manifest anything. Not feeling like you were fulfilled. So you definitely know that that was something that you did not want to stay in. So, Four of Cups is how you're feeling now. Just um, a bit hurt still. But guess what, Pisces? You are doing things to help fill your own cups. Right? It may be a slow process, but you are able to see and rise above the situation. You're able to see positivity out of it. You're able to see that it is time to move forward. It is time to um, just not stay in this um, non-manifestation -manifest energy, okay? So we are going to do an oracle card. We have embracing and inner peace. Coming out of the forgiveness energy in the reverse. So yes, Pisces, you may have felt like you could not forgive this person. <laughs> you may have felt like, how in the world can I really forgive you after what you've done, after what you've said to me, after how you've treated me? But Pisces know that this person they feel it. They feel your absence out of their life. If you have been feeling their energy as like just maybe thinking of them a lot or I, I can't explain it, but trust and believe just, you know, the things that you are feeling, they're feeling them too or they're going to feel them, you know? We're all alike. We, we all have the same feelings. Man, woman, black, white, any other nationality. They feel it, Pisces. I don't think they don't feel that, okay? But guess what? You're embracing your pain. And you're embarking on a new journey, right? And while you're embarking on a new journey, you have more inner peace. And you're doing the work to keep that inner peace going, okay? So just know, Pisces, that this, this heartbreak, this trying time, was to help guide you into your higher self, okay? To get you ready for the love that you deserve. Okay, Pisces, that's all I have for you at this time. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I thank you so much for stopping by and checking me out. Please leave me a comment in the comment section to let me know how this reading resonates with you. And as always, Pisces, stay blessed, stay focused. Until next time, bye.